what's going on this is a waste back with another video so this is a very short video uh, I just want to share some of the settings in Windows 10 anniversary update what I changed to get back then performance uh, let me tell you one thing that I had an update like uh, two weeks ago right and since I got an update my computer was really laggy very slow I was wasn't able to get the same performance what I was having on my Windows 10 PC it's a laptop basically so uh, I figured out a way to improve the performance and get back the the same snappy performance what I had with the Windows 10 original update right so uh, I'm gonna tell you my specs for my laptop it's core i7 I've got 16 gig of RAM and I've got a G4 GDX 950M graphics cards it's pretty okay so uh, I was wondering what are the settings that what why it became really slow it, it was so pain in the ass and then I'll, I'll, uh, for two days I actually literally sit here and then wait for my computer to start and if I want to use Photoshop I would just sit here and wait for like three minutes to start the Photoshop that was awful so finally I figured out a way to fix that problem and I want to share with you guys so it's very simple all right all you have to do is just right click here and then go to your control panel okay so once you're in a control panel uh, you have to search for performance okay and then in the system adjust appearance and performance just click here okay and here this is the main thing you need to uh, understand okay right now my computer is adjust for best appearance all right well it's up to you you want best uh, uh, best appearance or you want best performance so for me I want best performance I don't care about the appearance okay so I will click on adjust for best performance but there's one thing you need to keep it on which is uh, smooth edges for screen fonts right so screen smooth scroll these boxes as well so these two settings are important that you could see the text uh, smooth so I'll just keep that on and then let's go to advanced tab all right in the advanced tab it's telling you the process scheduling and adjust for best performance for programs and Windows services so here if you come down here virtual memory it's a uh, it's a packing file in an area on the hard drive that Windows uses as if it were a RAM okay so here if you go to change all right and here I've changed that to 4000 recently to gain the performance but I have that recommended 2933 okay but when I came to this tab for the first time and I realized that my recommended was 2933 and I, I was actually allocating uh, 2200 MB which was even lower than recommended okay so I would recommend if you have like 8 gig of RAM so put that here about whatever the recommended the minimum you need to put in recommended okay Windows will tell you so if you put the recommended value here okay uh, it should improve your performance as it did for me uh, my computer was like really laggy and uh, it was it was hard to use it so I changed that to 4000 because I have 16 gig of RAM so that's why so uh, change that to recommended 2933 MB and uh, it will tell you mine is 2933 yours may be different you might seeing like one gig of RAM here which is recommended for your PC okay so it's all about the PC so whatever it says recommended change that and put that value in initial MBs and maximum size MB as well and then you click OK apply okay once you apply it click OK and that's it that's it all you have to do is after this you have to restart your system and if you do improve your laptop or PC performance please let me know in the comments below and if there are other settings you want to recommend that this would this could uh, improve the performance as well so let me know in the comments as well and thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and I'll talk to you guys in the next video and stay tuned for these kind of short videos and tips and tricks all right so cheese for that all right all right cheese